guys, welcome back to the channel. We're just speaking up from yesterday. Uh, this is what we have done this far. This is a quick latch. The keys put it on the driver's side. I still need to put this one on this side. Um, so I'm just going to open the bootlet for you guys to show you quickly a glimpse of how it does work. And then I'm going to install the other side as well. I'm not going to explain how I do the other side. It's just basically going to be time lapses on how I do the other side as well. And I'll do an explanation on how the quick latch works. As you guys can see, it is sagging up here because of um, because of the hinges not being connected there's actually nothing connected here so that is why the alignment looks like that uh, but i assure you once um, the other quick latches over here it will basically press this back and then there's e there is um, options to align as well so i'll just align that up as well for you guys um, so let's get to it So this is also how it kind of works. I'm just going to show you guys quickly. So that means that the whole bootlet is loose basically. I can remove it. And then just to click it back. That's how it clicks back. Okay guys, I just thought I'll show you a little trick. So basically I'm going to use the cardboard over here. Um, I am going to basically measure uh, the cardboard over here. I'm just going to draw the shape of the bootlet. Once I have the shape cut out, I'm basically going to move this over here. And then just draw the circle as to where um, the circle is over this side. And basically I'll just flip it and put it on this side and then it will be placed on the exact same place so I just thought I'll share that with you guys as well however underneath there is only one spot you can uh, mount it it's only provision for one quick latch uh, but I just thought I'll just use this method to have um, the correct or to have the correct balance between uh, the two quick latches guys can see on this side of here basically cut out the cardboard matching the body or matching um, the bootlet like that over there basically just remove it and flip it around place it on this side and then you have an idea as to uh, where it should be placed um, this is the circle is done free and however I am going to use this just to make the circle um, the correct shape so guys something I picked up um, when I did um, the first quick latch I kind of drilled small assuming that I would have um, of these to basically make it bigger however these stuff actually wear very easily that is also the reason why I needed to get some stone grinders so what I'll be doing uh, this time around is I'm actually going to go uh, make a little, a little bit bigger than normal also this is my last um, grinding uh, footing uh, I don't think it's in a loss but I do just want to create the shape and then I'll see from there um, also on this side um, you can't see it actually but I just use a normal drill and then I created the holes and then I just basically use a stone uh, grinder to, to make the hole smoother 
I think you guys might have seen that in the previous uh, video as well. So I might just do this on this side because this side is actually much thicker actually. Um, don't mind the circle. Um, this is not the correct measurement. Actually the correct measurement is on this side. So yeah. So the sticker will basically cover up everything and then keep out the water as well. I was seeing of going for different color. Um, these are the color options. You said the chrome won't work. Uh, white would have maybe been a good idea. But I do think uh, the matte black is going to look pretty cool. Okay guys, so I have extremely bad news. Um, if you look at this hole, it's much bigger. Um, so what basically happened here was when I used um, this method, I assumed that the hole has to be this big, when in actual fact, the hole only had to be this big. So now the problem is that uh, this is basically too small for this. So I am going to order bigger ones and then just use this in the front. Um, but in the meanwhile, um, I did also, what is it? Did want this to happen, but I do want to show you guys that I am actually capable of uh, fixing uh, mistakes. So, as you can see, this little um, stick over here. So, my whole plan is basically to, to use that as a cover up. Also, what I am going to do is I am going to use this cut out over here, make the circle bigger so that it can fit over here basically. So, once that is mounted onto here, um, I don't know if you guys can see this and that, that will basically remain there. So the thing will still be uh, functional. Uh, what I will then also do is, uh, I'm, I'm unable to weld, so I'm going to seal this basically closed. Uh, maybe just paint um, all the exposed metal and then just seal this closed. And once I'm done, I'll basically just use the sticker to put the cover up. Uh, the sticker does kind of look cool. Um, I was thinking of maybe going white so that it's maybe more visible. I was also thinking of a red reflector, but unfortunately uh, my friend does not have um, a red reflector um, decal or sticker. So unfortunately I'm gonna have to go with the, with the black. I uh, wouldn't say actually unfortunately I actually do like the matte black. Be in mind this is a little bit um, too small. I have made ones that are uh, a bit bigger. So what I'm going to do is just stick this over here, see what it looks like uh, if it's big enough to cover up and then we just have to keep on moving forward. So guys this is kind of an idea what it will look like when I will be using a bigger sticker. So this will basically go over there and then the sticker will also serve um, purpose because then it will also keep out the rain etc. Um, like I mentioned, I am going to order bigger ones that will be slightly bigger than these as well. I do like them big because they are much noticeable and it will basically um, 
give the whole, or would say it will be much noticeable. So whenever someone sees it, they will actually um, think what it actually is. Um, so yeah, that's kind of cool. Um, it does suck that I did drill the hole a little bit bigger, but at least it's a, a learning curve for me. I can just basically see what I can do um, or basically fix it. So yeah, it's, it is a bit of um, a bad thing, but I guess we have to learn. And like I mentioned, or like um, DJ always say, keep moving forward.